and a very warm welcome to 20 minute meals. My name is Felicitas Steen and I will show you how to make delicious food in under 20 minutes. Today we make fasolada, a Greek and very traditional soup with a lot of beans. So let's start. Okay, I will get my equipment. Okay, I have a pot, blue and white, Greek colors, kind of, and my chopping board. So for the fasolada, we need celeriac. I will cut it in very fine pieces. I love celeriac because whenever you use it, it gives the sauce or the soup a very intense flavor. Like it feels deeper, you know? <laughs> it doesn't feel like, oh, there's a lot of celeriac. It just feels like, yes, flavor, flavor, flavor. And that's what we want. What else do we need? Of course, onions, because onions are also a very basic, very important vegetable in cooking. I have some carrots. I will not peel the carrots because we only have 20 minutes. If you are lazy, you can also cut it in slices. You don't have to do it in very fine pieces like I do. Just make sure you make it in under 20 minutes. <laughs> Cutting is done. Now I have some very good olive oil. And now I will fry all the vegetables. This also looks a little bit Greek, huh? As there are only 20 minutes, I will not cut the garlic, but just grate it. It's a very easy and quick way. Get your grater and then... Mm -hmm. I already love the smell of onions and the garlic and the olive oil. Mm. I was in Greece last year and I love the way they eat. You know the meze, the very small starter plates and you put a lot of them on the table and you share everything and you get your pita bread and dip it into tzatziki and everything. <sighs> I think Greek cuisine is a little bit underrated. So eat more Greek food like fasolada. What else do I have? I have a chili. I'm not sure whether this is really Greek but it's very feely so. If you like it spicy, Put it in. In with the red chilies. I have two bay leaves. And then I have some fresh thyme from my balcony. These little leaves survive the very cold Berlin gray winter. For the soup, I have tinned tomatoes and vegetable stock. Of course, you could cook your own vegetable stock, but then it's not a 20 minute meal anymore, but a two hour meal. To season the soup, I have some oregano, salt and pepper and a little bit of sugar. This was very, very quick. And now I'm cheating a little bit because I use pre-cooked white beans because otherwise it would take a lot of time. But a little bit of cheating. It's okay, I think. Five minutes left. I will clean up a little bit and then toast the pita bread. So what do you think about Greek food? What's your favorite dish? Please comment below. If you want to see more 20 minute meals, don't forget to subscribe to our channel DW Food and leave a nice comment below. For the pita bread, I use some olive oil. If you have some time left and I have two minutes, then you can just <laughs> use two more cloves of garlic to give it a little bit more flavor. This soup is also very nice for meal prep. You could make a big pot and eat it tomorrow or the day after. The last thing I do, I chop a little bit of flat leaf parsley for color and for taste and for decoration. It's time to plate. bread done, everything in under 20 minutes. Yes! <laughs> Time to eat. I have this very beautiful plate. To be honest, it's from Portugal and not from Greece, but I think it's okay. My twist is to put a little bit of Greek yogurt on top 
and some fresh parsley. Yes. Okay, wow, this soup is so aromatic and full of flavor and I love the combination of hot soup and cold yogurt. Mm. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to DW Food and I say if caristo and goodbye. Mm.